over 10 years ago, uh, when I when I start uh, going hiking in Hong Kong, and then I start the uh, sketching around during my hike, and at that time I really admired so much uh, the the paintings, the landscape paintings in in European countries, um, because in in art history we always have the ideas of a very sublime uh, landscape painting uh, during the Romanticism and also um, uh, uh, the, the Impressionist painters. And uh, what I really like is the, uh, some of the British painters like John Constable. Be before him, is there, there is some more just like Gainsborough and also after, after the Impressionism. Also, uh, we, we can find so many um, uh, contemporary uh, British painters like David Hockney and also uh, Peter Doy. Um, all these painters really got some impact on my um, development of my landscape painting. But John Constable will be one of the uh, important painters that um, uh, so far I, I, I still got a very strong feeling on his painting and also on his passion of landscape painting. The, the, the visual elements on, on his painting is more about his, um, his love on the surrounding uh, area that he uh, grow, grown up with. His painting, you can feel a very strong connection with him and the, the place he paints. It seems like to be uh, a mentor of my painting. There, there are also um, some new, for me, is, is some um, new British painters that I, I recently like, just like uh, Sacrat. I saw his painting also in the Asmolean Museum. I really love his use of the brush stroke and also the, the color tones to also paint the, uh, some of the daily life in, in UK. Now when I work on the paintings, I, I can find so many different uh, elements from different types of painters in, in my memory. And also, uh, I also got the uh, experience from my real sketching uh, on, on the site. I, I like to have this type of connections with the with the painters from, from the art history.